Hi guys, welcome to today's video where I'm gonna talk about the future of this channel. Yes, I am back in Germany, but not for long. So when this video comes out, I will not be in Germany anymore. I will go to China for a whole three months and then I will come back for a short time and then again three months as a volunteer chess teacher in the Jihon Chess Club Bengbu. You can google it if you can find something. It's gonna be a super amazing time, I hope. So I'm enjoying my room here that I've been missing for one year. I would say, let's check the room out, let's go. that looked cool. Now I want to talk a little bit about the future of the channel because I've had some ideas and some inspiration about what to do and I kind of want to do a little bit more because I have the gear. I was trying to get a good mic for the camera but unfortunately it doesn't have the flash adapter and no audio jack so I can't put a mic on there and all my other cameras don't have either and my cell phone doesn't work with the mic so whatever it's just a lost time and um, so in China we'll maybe try to do some other things. I was thinking about opening a new channel because yeah I'm interested in um, like starting a new topic that I can not vlog about but do like um, more uh, topics which I can invest more time in because yeah you see at the moment I'm just vlogging and it does take its time to edit and Sometimes I make it cool, sometimes the last videos were just stock footage that I had from some while ago in Hiroshima and you know uh, from uh, winter in Japan. Uh, they were not really great, I had my old camera that's not stabilized so the shots were really shaky, I hated editing it. But yeah, so I hope that I can get a new challenge, new ideas in China. I was thinking about um, doing like a vegan around the world channel that would be quite cool but yeah it's it's quite a asked topic and I have to say I'm not vegan myself but I'm interested many people are interested so um, I would like to explore this field and of course there's some other topics like reviewing camera gear but there's so many channels who do that already like I have the new GoPro that I really would like to review because it's really good but yeah, it's, it's just a pain to make such a video. I like interacting with people so I was thinking about doing like a culture thing, cultural differences, China, Germany, Germany, Japan, something like that because I am going to go back to Japan in winter um, so I don't know if I'm gonna film anything <laughs> except the trips by plane because it's boring so I don't have anything else to do than filming it and editing it on the way so yeah we're gonna see how this all goes and I hope that I can have a great time in China and the reason why I want to do some little bit more serious stuff is on one hand my own perspective my own goals but also on the other hand I've had some I've had now two kind of clients for whom I've done some videos. So yeah, I'm thinking that maybe it's time to get a little bit more, you know, professional and the vlog videos can stay of course. That's 
very funny for me. I can just hold the camera and do some funny stuff. That's really cool. That's how I started. I want to definitely continue the channel. And yeah, so in China I was thinking about doing these little more, more serious things if I have the time, that is of course. But yeah, China's culturally so interesting. So I might try some funny things. Maybe not on this channel though. Another thing I wanted to do was a day to night time lapses. You know, I've got all these GoPro batteries that I got for free, at least two, and the other ones are from two other GoPros. And yeah, I just wanted to try a day to night time lapse, and I discovered that my little OD VRM camera, I can link it to an external power source and then it can record until its card is full and fortunately this one is a camera which cuts the uh, pictures already into a time time lapse so that's really cool I can record really long of that now the weather has not been playing with me the other day and that I took this time lapse because it started to rain and my window was open so I couldn't record the whole day but yeah I might try something that's a real like fun project for me and also this big camera it's not really good because it doesn't have a real time-lapse mode which can like take the pictures in two second interval or something like that it's just like 50 minutes it's time-lapsing you don't need to do anything so that's a little bit unfortunate it's not really professional but yeah when it comes to camera gear this is the perfect camera for me to vlog it's compact uh, it has a flip screen, it has 4K, which is really good for the price that I got it. And yeah, you should definitely check it out if you want to start vlogging. Then of course you need a little tripod that you can get for a few euros. So if it comes to camera gear, it's well not perfect to do some things like time lapses, except this little guy here. Um, but on the other hand, I love it just for vlogging and yeah, the audio is crap, but I can't do anything against it. <laughs> and never mind. So that was it from today's video, probably also from Germany. If you like the stuff that I put out, these kind of vlogs and sometimes a little bit more serious video, like the one about plastic in Japan, I recommend you to like the video and subscribe and hit the notification button so that, uh, that when you su subscribe, uh, my new videos also comes into your subscription box. So make sure to do that and follow me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter maybe, whatever. Just have a great time and if you're making videos, stay creative and see you next time. I need my cap. My cap is over here. Close the camera. Bye bye.